Today we are going to have some king fun, so stick around to find out more about the Jaguar step. Hey everyone, my name is Eddie Wang and welcome to Monday Tech. And today we have a character that has never been on this channel before. Of course I'm talking about the ultimate grappler and I'm talking about King. King is a character that is every grappler player wet dream because he has a throw for every single situation. If you are in the air, King has throws. If you are on the ground, King, King has throws on the floor. If you are crouching, King also has throws and if you are standing, obviously King also has throws. He also has a 10 frame throw which is pretty problematic. If you haven't heard about the giant swing before, it looks like this. It's a very strong throw that you, you have to take. Either way you're going to eat a lot of damage from it. And on top of being a 10 frame throw, it's a one break but the animation looks like a two break so it's like a really scary throw and but this is that something that we are going to cover today it's only part of it but today we are going to talk about this problematic move right here which is the jaguar step and the jaguar step is one of one of the things that king got in tekken 5 when he got the mexican magma drive uh, combos which is a multi throw that comes from this setup and this is a setup that can do, can be do with two throws. You can do with one four, which is a one break, and a, and a two three, which is a two break. So, but to get you to this point, King has to condition you into not duck and to not uh, move around. So how he does it is extremely important, and it comes down to this step right here, the Jaguar step. So he has this elbow right here and this elbow is going to track to King's left. So if you are trying to sidestep King to the left, know, your, know yourself that it's impossible to sidestep this to the left because it's going to hit you. So you're going to have to go the other way around in order to dodge this move. But he also has a kick that tracks to the other side which tracks to king's right so you cannot sidestep to that side uh, knowing that he's going to make this kick work so it's going to hit you if you are trying to sidestep to the right uh, to the left right if you're trying to sidestep to, to your left uh, you are going to get hit uh, by this kick and if you are trying to sidestep to your right uh, you are going to get hit uh, by by the elbow so it's a conditioning thing and both of these options are safe but they are high so you can duck but then king has this move right here which is as you guys can see this is pretty quick he's 11 frames start up and it's going to track either direction you go you cannot step this sorry you cannot step this and this is minus nine on block so if you block this uh, you King is going to lose his turn, so you are free to apply pressure. Just be careful because he also has like a a parry for kicks and a parry for throws, but uh, for 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 punches. Sorry, a parry for punches and a parry for kicks. So you have to be extremely careful when on King's zone. But he has this, and this is this is insane. That's because at minus nine. He's going to condition you to not move either way, so he gets to, Mex to Mexican Magma drive you, he gets to kick you uh, without uh, you being too... If you are too scared to duck, then it's because you are already respecting this move, but why would you respect this move, right? So I'm going to show you real quick what happens if you don't duck this move. So he has this kick, which he can set up throws from it because it's plus eight like for example his giant swing can be set up from this and he's going to do a lot of damage if you don't take but then let's say that you can duck this right so let's set the character to duck this and this is minus 12 on hit 
and it doesn't matter if you are ducking or if you are standing this is still going to be minus 12 on hit and every single time this hit for example his, his crouching throws are going to be guaranteed this is a guaranteed throw this is a guaranteed throw and it's not only that he also has a multi throw to catch you just in case you are throwing, trying to duck him in this situation which can be also used there and make it a guaranteed throw for example he can do this and that and you are in for like a for a, a real combo and he can go full combo i just don't didn't forget the last input i had to to hold all buttons to get it but i really forgot but that's the point so it is going to make like really scary to duck in because he has this stuff so when you are too afraid to duck king too afraid to move around now he gets to use the mexican magma drive and forces you to guess between breaks and if you are not and you keep ducking this then it that it won't matter either way because he's still going to throw you and he can mix that like the throws as you guys can see he can either go for one or go for the other and that's just how how king is so you have to be extremely careful around his zone he also has a mid kick but this kick is a homing you cannot step either way but it's it's uh it's unsafe at minus 16 and in season 3 a lot of characters can punish king from this range so isn't exactly a safe kick to begin with because it's minus 16 so a lot of characters in the game can punish this and he also has the sobat which is minus 5 on block and it's safe and he can also go into the death press and he can double spin and if he double spins this it becomes minus 1 uh, this one also becomes minus 1 and this one becomes minus 2 on block so you have to be extremely careful and then the kick becomes unblockable so really careful around king because he really is here to uh, to destroy you if you are too afraid of this so the best option is trying to interrupt but you have to be really quick and it's a really guessing situation there isn't much there isn't much to it and you're gonna have to learn to deal with this so the best options what pro pro player recommend is paying attention to what he's doing you are only in danger of, of the throw so you're gonna have to learn how to break his his throws one is a one break and the other is a two break and this is an insane command throw if you ask me this is pretty crazy because the follow-ups are always a one break or a two break throw and in between this one break and two break uh because this is a multi throw as well uh, let me see if i can still remember one command from it is uh, let's see this is yes there is this and then he can go from there and he has like a two one let's see if i can still remember at least part of it so is this one two three four then he has this which is also a uh, this is a one break the command i did is for a one break but then you can also mix this this one uh this second one is unbreakable you cannot break that throw but then he has like a then this is a two break command but the throw is the same as the one break command so you have to guess uh which one he has used uh, but the idea is that he is leading you into a super insane command command throw combo that is going to do a lot of damage uh, if i remember correctly uh there is one i'm referring to this one as you guys can see so this is a uh, this is a one break this is unbreakable then this is a one break the the ai only does with one break this is a one break and this is not breakable then this is a one break as well so but in between all these one break throws there is also a two break throws for each one of them 
and is what makes like the Mexican magma drive like a really dangerous move. You have to be really careful aro around this because it's easy to implement. Uh, you can hold the both the both uh, the both kick buttons, and either you press one from it. If you press one from it, it's going to do the one break, and if you press the two, it's going to do the, the two breakthrough. So. A really, really scary, really scary, scary stuff for from King, and you have to be really careful around it. And he can mix this with the with the reversal uh, arm arm bar throw. This one right here, and there are ways to make him go in into this throw as well. Uh, I just don't remember right now, but this is something that King has. So you have to be really careful around. Uh, King zone with with this stuff and in, in the Mexican magma drive, so it really that crazy. So whenever you fight King, learn to break his throws because he is a really dangerous grappler. Probably the best grappler in history of fighting games, and there is no one rivaling this carrot. He is just insane. So hope you guys enjoyed the video, and see you guys on the next Monday Tech, on of course on Friday with more Gene videos. See you guys soon.